in a sack. But Triss Merigold insisted I be patient and courteous. Was I? I couldn't have handled it better myself. Ha! I always knew you were one of us. And bugger what folks say. They talked about Adder no end. Have you learned anything about the assassin? Triss did an autopsy. It's possible he was a witcher. A witcher? What have I ever done to the ploughing witchers? Anything more? He had no medallion, but that doesn't mean anything. Many in your shoes would have withheld that information. After the battle, Triss will report to me. For now, let us tend to the traitors. Where are you aiming, imbeciles? Soldier! Spyglass! What is going on up there? The gods! Count at your belly! Catch, Witcher! Aim for the rogue with the red plume. Not six months ago, he swore eternal friendship to me. Quickly! How much higher? Three degrees. Did we hit the bastard? He ducked. Damn it. We'll get him on the walls. Follow me, Witcher. I am no warrior, sir. I must at Fine, we man. To be remembered by Forgive your grip the adder this black one. I could ha! have you learned nothing new, sir. Months passed and we don't know any more than we knew when we began. This investigation is going nowhere. My agents have learned little also. But we'll find the culprits. It's just a question of time. Now for the battle. I want you at my side today. Then you may go where you please. Thank you, sire. Where are you aiming, imbeciles? Soldier! Spyglass! One and a half degrees. Did we hit the bastard? He's down. Ha! One less traitor. Time to attack. Follow me, Witcher! You know, Witcher, I'm prepared to forgive Louisa. All she need do is to kneel before her king. Very noble of you. 
you mocking me? Never mind. I'm certain Louisa will realize her mistakes. Besides, children should have a mother. I'm lost. It's quite simple. Louisa and I had a bit of a tiff. She made demands I could not fulfill. Understand? I think so. Count Echeverry and others immediately intervened, all noble, all sympathetic. They claimed the evil king would take her children, but they would protect them, even place them on the throne. And the Baroness was duped, a motherly love used. In truth, they desire privileges that would weaken the throne. That's a swiving soldier's life! Taking orders, smash your bow! Going and country, there your wife! And a long road at Chitso! When you're plowing for your king, blood and mud, your brow a sweat, balls in a bandage, brick in a snake. <laughs> That's a sp- <laughs> was ridiculous. It was designed to break the rebels' morale. A bunch of lords and lordlings took a ride to then pompously stride on top of the walls, while the real army fought and died below them in the shit and piss-filled streets. If years of service have taught me anything, it's that the Highborn don the best costumes and get the best vantage points, whether at a ball or in battle. But it's not the time for that kind of jousting, Witcher. Continue your story. Foltes bastards. The Solar. What happened? We might have arrived at the same time if not for tales. Be specific, Witcher. Well, the Archpriest told the truth. His Majesty King Foltest of Temeria. Arthur Tales, erstwhile Count of Nesvelt. I signed your sentence. Yes, yet the Baroness saw fit to pardon me. An awkward situation, to be sure. Anais and Busi, where are they? The royal children. Don't test my patience, Tales, and I'll grant you a quick death. Confess, Foltest, before the gods and the people. Busi and Anais are the fruit of your loins. Bow to the gods and admit the truth. You may not have noticed, Tales, but I just took this town. Aided by murderers, sorcerers, and a mutant for whom nothing is holy. This is hallowed ground. You will not raise your hand against a servant of the gods. Where have you taken the children? The Solar. They're in the Solar. What is this? Blasphemy! Sorcerer's tricks! <laughs> Holy man unharmed and the noble gets slapped. A win-win situation, if ever I've seen one. Damn, I've seen assaults go awry, but the dragon topples them all. Tops. What? The world's in a world. Mutant. Free. Well.
damn nonsense. Geralt, you should know. Is it possible to tame a dragon? Not as far as I know. Then why is this reptile eating only mine, then? Let's hope Marigold got out of there. I'm sure she did. The dragon's back! 